In Yaroslav, the first in this area house for intellectually disabled people had been constructed. It's not only a roof over their heads, but also self-efficiency training. The house that was uh, the idea of the parents of the disabled had been in construction for nine years. At first, the house will be inhabited by seven people, and amongst them, Marek. I have a cabinet, a bed, and I will also have other things here. Jarek also can't wait to move. I will have a rest from my house. I can say I will be in my prime here, or my private place. It's nice here. The inhabitants will have their own separate rooms with toilets. They'll have a common kitchen and big bathroom. The idea of this house was initiated by parents of the intellectually disabled. Each parent has the knowledge that they won't live forever and there may be a time that the child is left without help or a place to live. Another important thing is that the house offers companionship, which the inhabitants often don't have elsewhere. In their own community, they feel great. I can say that about my daughter. Uh, when she has to stay home on Sunday, there's a problem. The inhabitants will have to take care of themselves, clean, cook, shop. Uh, a so-called assistant will have them help them with everyday tasks. The role of the assistant is not to take care of a disabled person, but to support with personal tasks or shopping or other things. This year, the disabled will live in the house for a few days each month. Next year, they will live here permanently.